Here we are, the visitor center. This is such a special place. What is this? A box shaped like Taiwan? This is a traditional Taiwanese handcraft pen. From left to right, they represent four crafts, indigo dyeing, rush weaving, wood carving, and oil paper umbrella. I've never heard of them. Can you explain this craft a bit? Of course. Indigo dyeing is a technique for natural dyeing. In the past, Sansha was an important base for fabric dyeing. I see. What about the pen with a poem on it? This pen represents the oil paper umbrella, which originated from Meinong Kaohsiung. The first word of each sentence of the Chinese poem is about the craft. Yu zhi san, oil paper umbrella. What is the function of the colored paper next to the oil paper umbrella? This paper can be folded into a simple paper umbrella and assembled onto the pen. There are folding instructions for paper umbrella in the QR code. Wow! It's fabulous. What about the other two pens? The other two are wood carving and rush weaving development in Miaoli. The one with the woven pattern on top is rush weaving. A traditional weaving technique using rush. The illustration on the top depicts the way a female artisan wishing rushes. The origin of wood carving in Taiwan is san yi, so we carve san yi to honor it on the pen. This sticky note is really pretty. Yes, those animals on the sticky note represent the four regions, famous for their traditional handcrafts, right? Exactly. There's also some space for writing on the note pad. And you can also scan the QR code next to it. Is this an app and website introducing traditional crafts? Wow! There is so much information and they even offer an English version. I have no problem understanding it at well. That's so cool. The app even has a question and a game to play. The design on this box lid is really clever. I can see the four crafts. Speaking of which, these traditional crafts are hardly seen nowadays because they are disappearing. My grandmother used to have a workshop for indigo dyeing and she always says that modern people prefer factory made stuff. So these old crafts are being forgotten. So that's why these traditional handcraft pens are made. We hope these traditional handcrafts will be sustainable. This is so meaningful and useful. Hope everyone knows these beautiful Taiwanese traditional crafts. How about this? I'll buy four pens and when I go back home, I will tell it to my family and my friends. I want to buy four of them too. 
It's my honor to buy the pens and to help preserve the handcrafts. Great. Each pen costs 350 NT dollars. Thanks for making efforts for Taiwan.